in the mix with Jake Man and Skeletor. What's up, y'all? Crib Show. Right now, we at We Love Asia. I've got Skeletor and Jake Man holding it down. What's going on, guys? Um, actually, we're quite excited to see you. I haven't seen Vandal in like ages, and he's looking a bit Richard Garish to me. <laughs> That's what I tell the ladies. <laughs> How are you doing, man? I'm really good. And you know what? Like, it's been a while since uh, we've had a chance to catch up and talk. And like, I really like to know what you guys have got going on now. Like, I know you guys have been working together for a long time, doing shows, nights, uh, late night sessions. T tell us, tell us, tell us a bit more. For me, it's more of a hobby because I'm doing it like 33 years, so it's my 33rd year. Um, we do one gig a month, two gigs a month. We got I got two shows on uh, one on hits, one on mix. Um, just keeping it alive, like you know what I'm saying. Just enjoying myself. Um, let's see how far it goes. Skeletor has been doing it for what seven, eight years. Seven, eight years. Yeah, yeah. we've got some shows lined up. I think we're going to do obviously, which is coming up real soon, though. So really excited about that. Besides that, it's all the way radio stuff, our club hits. Yeah. It's birthday bash on the 28th. Um, we got a couple of years. You know, this is the best, best time, best period, the fourth quarter. So just enjoying myself, you know, enjoying the new technology, you know. Social media is definitely like a weapon for all the artists and everybody out there to like get the word out not only in Malaysia but all over the world because Crip Show we, we broadcast everywhere on AFO Radio. I heard a couple of your shows, love it, love what you guys are doing you know, you're working from ground up and uh, you know you never know you might hit mainstream soon. Yeah. Well we have, we have, the, we have plans for that but we'll see what happens but in the meantime man you know like I, re I really want to get your feedback because I know Jake um, I saw I saw you saying your piece about Malaysian hip hop for the, for uh, ATV's word, which is coming out soon. Now, you've been in the scene for for a long time as like one of the founders and pioneers of Malaysian hip hop, and you've seen it come a long way. Uh, like from your experience tonight on uh, We Love Asia, we've had you know Pop Shove It, Project EAR. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Sona One, Joe Flizzo, Miss Nina, uh, tell me about uh, how it, like Malaysian music and everything has progressed. Uh, I think it's come a long way, but I think we still need new new voices, new sounds. But one, one person I'm really impressed with is uh, this guy called Waris from from uh, Fuzz's, one of Fuzz's uh, new kid. Really got his own sound. He's, he's doing it in Malay. He's, you know, I'm very impressed. When I heard that, I thought, wow, this sounds like a Malaysian Jaru. But he's got his own sound. He's got his own jargon. He's using. He's, he's real, and it's not trying to be anybody else. This is what I wanted to see, and finally, we, you know, I'm getting to see this. So I hope more Malaysian acts break out like this, and not try to emulate somebody else, but just be yourself. You know? Yeah. Yeah, that's the beauty of music because we represent our experiences and everything that we've gone through in life and where we're from, and that's something that. You know, really plays an important role in in especially the progression of the music industries in the places we are. Skeletor, wh what's been up with you, man? Like, what, like, what's new? I just got married. Yeah, hi, wifey. Anyway, um, yeah, I've been busy in the studio. Like I said, radio stuff, working on radio stuff, busy in the studio doing club hits, uh, working on some new tracks with him, bouncing out some ideas. Working on the Yeah, um, he he comes from a different angle, you know, when it comes to. Of the whole music perspective of it, to me is I, I love dance stuff a lot. So he tries to infuse all the local kind of stuff into it. So which is great. That's why I love working with him. You, you know what I really love about Malaysia is that the Malaysian industry, like on the media level, really supports the local artists. And I know that you guys, you've been doing your Met Ten, and you always support the local artists, whether it's like you know Prime Time or Met Ten or whatever for the programming. And as a Canadian. And from coming from Canada and and seeing how things happen here, like I would, I want to say to all the Malaysian hip hop artists or whatever, whatever you are, whatever artist you are, is that your media really supports you. So go and network and take advantage of the opportunities that you have in front of you because definitely these guys here, the, the pioneers, the, the foundation of the Malaysian music industry is in the building. 
I mean, you know, like I said, it's easy to get, get in touch with me. You can email me direct. If you got a track or what, you can send me a SoundCloud, your yeah, MP3s, whatever. Uh, Jakeman at hits.fm or Jakeman, Jake underscore Abdullah at astro.com.my. I'm listening to music all the time. Although I don't handle it directly, I'll send it to the right people. So we're always looking out for new music. Yeah. That's beautiful. Thanks a lot. Jakeman, Skeletor, The Crypt Show, represent. Thanks so much, guys, for being here tonight.